Hello, ladies and gentlemen. This is Weapon 2 coming at you with the next review. I know it's been a while, so we're going to do something a little different today. We're going to do this guy. This, uh, of course, is not the the original Pulpy or the, the Go Daikin version of Gordian. This is the Taiwan knockoff called Protector. And don't get me wrong, this is a really, really cool figure. I mean, I'm uh, just as blown away as I am with my other uh, diecast robot figures I have as well. And as, as for this guy, the, the Seth A. bot, whatever his name is, this is for another video. So, what we got here is uh, Protector in all his glory. He's got uh, a very hefty diecast metal and very sturdy plastic all over. Although the the original Pulpy in the Go Dying Converter has a very brittle plastic that was made by Pulpy and it it comes apart after age and <laughs> yeah, well this one this one has a plastic called ABS resin. It's a much more sturdier plastic. And it, it really rocks. So but before we get to this guy, we're gonna look at the the one that's in the box right now. I have like a three of these, but we're gonna look at two for now. All right, ready? Oh, look at this. This is the one that still has this box. This is not, not the, the one of the newer ones that they released in Taiwan. This is a this is a vintage version. And it's very similar, but it has some slight differences. Well, I'll get to that in a, another video. So, yeah, we got the name Protector here. We got self separation uh, on both the sides of the box here. I'll show you side to side. Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, it's got some uh, cardboard wear here too, but it still has this nice handle. And I think that's just about it here. It all has all these stock photos from the original Pulpy. What do you say we open it up and look at this one? Look at that. Um, this thing blows me away. It's, uh, yeah. This thing is awesome. I'm so glad I got this one. It's... Yeah, it's a uh, the deluxe set and it says the same thing like it does on the, on the box lid. Self-separation. Not bad, huh? Well, let's take this inner lid off. Of course, I'll back up to show you the whole thing instead of showing you side to side. Yeah. How about that? Okay. Now let's get ready. All right. And the contents here. We got the little instruction sheet here. We got the Garvin. We got Dillinger. What they call, don't call him Dillinger. They call him Dwarden. How about that? Um, his name is uh, like faded away. This happens on most of the Taiwan knockoffs of uh, Gar uh, Guardian slash Protector. And we got Protoster right here. And oh my goodness, this is very similar to what happened to Charger Power at the uh, Collection DX, um, also known as Rocket Punch Army. He had a, a Daiko figure. Yeah, his name is Daiko, the, the character in the. the the anime, the, the anime gar guardian or Gordian, and he too is a little sunk in there, and I believe his rubber is is hardened. So I'm not even going to try to pry him out or anything. Oh, of course, this guy doesn't come with a, a robotic panther named Clint. So it's kind of strange. I guess Taiwan wasn't very interested in him for some reason. I don't. I really don't know. And we got the sword here, but. You see how the sword is packaged in here? It's a, a little shortened for some reason. Um, I can't figure out why, but it doesn't bother me. It, you see how the the rest of the interior here is, is, is a little, you know, further up away, and then the 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 blade is a little a little shorter here. <laughs> and we got the laser screw here. I, I think that's what it's called. Um, we got his weapons. We got these little pods here you put on the, the on them as well. 
And we got the shield. Look at that. Oh, and we got the the red light sword here. This is something else. I think that's what it is, a red light sword. This I'm not quite sure, but that's my closest guess. This is a very awesome set, I would say. So, yeah, yeah. You're looking at a, a genuine vintage uh, for Guardian's Flesh Protector that still has its own package. Well, how, how cool is that? Alright, now let's get back to the, the loose one. Hey, going back to this guy here. So. Okay, he's... Yeah, we all know he's like a, a Russian nesting doll. Well, yeah, that's what I like about him. He has a nice feature, this guy. Well, we got his weapons here. Well, they're all... They're in the package. Uh, not in the package, but in the plastic bag. Yeah, see, I gotta I'll show you it clearly so you can see better. Oh, of course, he's got all the, the swords. Well, he's got most of the, his weapons, not not all of them, and including his uh, his trusty old sword and his shield, but it's missing a, a handle on it. I'm still on the lookout for the, the handle that goes to this shield. I'll I'll, I'll find it eventually, but if not now, maybe a uh, Soon, soon enough. I'm quite sure they they sell spare parts of them on eBay. That's where I got the other the weapons. This one's loose here. Yeah. So um, I'm gonna show you them from top to bottom. Let's see. Yes, he's his chest is and his back are diecast as well as his feet. I like to put him in his pose. So it looks like he's. He's energizing. So, uh, what do you say we separate them? Or just plain take them apart? Alright, well, to get that done, I'm going to lift these chrome parts up here on his, his biceps. And his head, it flips backward. And of course, you want to open his thighs like so. Now, we're going to lift up his chest right here. And we're going to set free this guy Dillinger he even says Dillinger in this one and here oh yes and now we're going to close these up here next yeah he's got a loose arm that doesn't bother me so this one's harder to get get closed hold on there we go I'll put these down. Now to get the other, the other robot out. Of course, I'm gonna put the camera down like this. Okay. Now you do the same way. Open these up, and as well as the, the thighs on Dillinger here. There we go. Now for the head. Pull it back. Uh, you open this up. This doesn't know his head doesn't flip up that much. It's um, it makes it a little more tricky to get him out. So bear with me. Okay, now we're gonna get this guy <sighs> like so. Okay. Okay. We got these. Oh, he doesn't want to stand up. <laughs> Nope, he doesn't want to stand up. Okay. I'll just do it that. <laughs> what I'm going to do is um, put him back a little further so he, he can stand. There! Now i got to do this. Um, put his head down. Now we're going to put his arms down too. As we'll do it on Protester. This is the smallest robot. Though, he doesn't come with that Daigo figure. Yeah, because 
These two here, let me show you. These two here, they they didn't originally come with the Garmin didn't originally come with them because I'll show you. This is the box they came on. Yeah, the Gordian Junior set. It says new. Well, it was back then, but now it's uh, it's it's like over over thirty. 37 years old, I believe. Uh, yeah. Two in one robot. Well, uh, luckily I was able to find the, a Garvin for them that's loose. Though there's nothing really wrong with putting them inside this guy. <laughs> Even though they didn't come together. Yeah, he's. They both got their own weapons here. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this guy he gets a gets a sword. The other ones, they they have the sword of their own. Yeah. I would hold. On, excuse me. I would put this the the sword that that the that this guy comes with, but it will not fit in his hand. So. The that the hilt that has it is is a little too thick and it's it's impossible to get in there. I don't know why they they made it so it doesn't fit in there. So this one is originally from a a genuine Go Daikin Guardian or Popey version. So he gets the sword. There we go. That that's the perfect fit. They both have launching fists too. The 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 red one and the and the blue one, and the small one doesn't have launching fists, but he has a, his own weapons here too. The green light sword, I think that's, I think that's it. That's it. quite sure it is. He's got a metal on him, on his his body and his his legs as well. Same thing with the uh, Dillinger. These are really, really cool. They're real close set together. Right. Yeah, I I don't know too much about the the anime, but I did catch a few episodes of it as well. Hopefully, oh, I'll, I'll, I'll be able to catch the whole show if I'm lucky. Yep, these guys have their potential. Yeah. They are very awesome. Both of them. And just as awesome as the uh, Pulpy Gold Daikin. But they're much more. They're not brittle or anything, so. Yeah. I'm, not to, I'm not trying to put down the, the Gold Daikin version or the original Pulpy, but I'm just saying these guys are really way cool. In my opinion, they are really way cool. Uh, they, they have a lot of die casts on them and, and the, the weapons and stuff. Hopefully I'll be able to complete their weapon stash. They are. They're awesome. Yeah. So, my, my, my rating for this, this set would be a perfect 10 out of 10. Because, yeah, you know I'm big on Voltron and Transformers and everything. These, these guys are, are all awesome. All the way, they are very, completely awesome. They have, they have cool features and everything else. So, yeah. Uh, soon, hopefully, I'll get to my my other review to, to review both the the three versions of the the Taiwan Protector as along with the. The Gold Daikin Guardian. So, this is what I wanted to show you for now. So, hope you enjoyed this review. Oh, and when I, if I ever get time around it or get any time to do another one, I'll, I'll do it as soon as I can. Yeah. So, I say if you if you had the money to 
by the the Taiwan protector. I mean, they go for it because, yeah, if you simply can't afford the the Gojaikin version, it's really up in price, like seventeen hundred dollars now. That's what my closest guess is, and uh, and the CM's Gordian as well as the so so those are like over three to three or not it's not five hundred dollars a piece. I do think about getting those as well. So, well, this concludes the review. And, um, I just wanted to show you what I got here, and it's, it's really awesome. So, I'll, I'll show you more soon, okay? So, until now, this is Weapon 2 signing off. Have a great day.